What's up fellas, Coach Tevin Blackman. And in this video, I wanna talk about men chasing women, all right? I think I made a video like this before, but I kinda of wanna get deeper and in depth with this, but I wanna keep this video short, sweet, and straight to the point. First of all, I wanna give my guys a round of a fucking applause because I'm starting to see the effect that us men becoming kings, realizing who the fuck we are, Realizing that we are the prize is starting to work. I'm starting to see more and more women on social media because I do watch women and what they say on social media sometimes, okay? I do a little slut shaming also, okay? Uh, but besides that, I'm starting to realize that women are starting to say that men aren't chasing as much anymore. Not enough men are chasing. All right, we're not giving these women what the fuck they want because we're starting to realize who the fuck we are. Okay, and we are fucking kings. We are the prize. See, if you feel like you have to chase women, understand that you aren't successful as a man. When you build value, when you add value to yourself as a man, you don't have to chase women. The women will chase you. And I'm going to give you guys a real good example of this shit. Okay? Okay. I'm about to put a picture on the screen right now. Many of you guys may know who, who this is, okay? Very successful guy, multi-millionaire, multiple companies. But the reason why he has all of these women is because he worked on himself. He added value to himself. And now he has an abundance of women. And I know a lot of you guys want the rotation. Some of y'all may want this shit, all these women. I personally don't like it, but you know, to each his own, but you may want that amount of women or two or three, whatever the case may be. But understand you will never get to that level, this level right here that you're looking at, you will never get to that level by just chasing women. Understand that women are like cats. I don't give a fuck if you own the cat, if the cat is yours. If you go chasing after your own cat, the household cat is gonna run from you like you a stranger. So with that being said, you shouldn't chase women. It's an unsuccessful approach at getting women. It's a very unsuccessful approach. Yeah, it may, it may work sometimes, right? But she's not going to treat you like a high value male. Once you do get with her, once you do get what you want, right? You want the woman to have equal interest in you. You don't have to... <laughs> Oh, 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 hey, baby, come in, 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 come in. Call and call and call and call and all this shit, texting, commenting, inbox, DM, whatever the case may be. You don't want to have to do that. You don't want to have to hound a woman into fucking with you. You want her to have interest in you enough to mess with you, right? And it's unsuccessful because once you do finally get with this woman, she's going to treat you like a fucking fan. Do you want to get treated like a fan? Well, don't chase. Like I said before, and I'll say it again and again and again. All right? I'll come back anybody day and night on this. When you, as a man, are in a position where you feel like you have to chase a woman, you are not successful as you can possibly be as a man. And what I mean by that is, if you have to chase down pussy, if you have to chase down a woman just to get her to fuck with you, that's a crying fucking shame. It's not good. You want women chasing you. And the best way to do that is to add value to yourself as a man. You want to become a high value male. All right. And a lot of you guys may be wondering, how can I do that? All right. I will make a series of videos speaking on this topic. Right. But what you want to do is you want to work on yourself self-development, become a real fucking king, semen retention, raise your testosterone so you can raise your attraction level, right? Women smell that pheromone, all right? You want to do that. You want to read books. You just want to add value. You just want to be a high value male, getting your fucking money right, getting your body right, building your business, whatever you got to do. And it's not about an image, right? It's not about looking successful. You want to actually be a successful man. So the women that's around you want to jump on this train you got going. She want to be on this train. It don't matter if she on the back part, the caboose, whatever they call it, the red part on the back. She just want to be on it some way, somehow. 
All right? And what I mean by that is you can have 15 women and she cool with being number 16. All right? But the only way that works is if you work on your goddamn self. All right? And just like the picture I just showed you guys, I'm going to show you another picture right now. This guy is very successful, man. He's very successful. And if you want to reach this level of success that you see right here on this screen, it takes large, large sacrifice. If you only want one woman in your life, you don't have to sacrifice that much. Just, you know, work on yourself. Do a little personal development, whatever you got to do, just to, you know, to attract a quality woman. But you, at the end of the day, you do not want to chase. Men are not supposed to be chasing women. I don't know where this shit comes from. I know most of it comes from what you see growing up as a kid, watching these corny ass movies, these love and basketball ass movies where, you know, we got the kid outside throwing rocks up at the window with the flowers downstairs, got the Mexican band behind him playing a love song and all this bullshit. That's bullshit. You are a king. You're not supposed to be chasing women. You are the prize. Like I said before, you are a king. Fucking act like it.